believed that. Hello. Nice well, today on my mind, like always, there's always a strange undertone of the satanic occults out there that are running our government into the ground. Our American government's been hijacked by alien greys. Fallen angels that are flying above every city that you can't see because they're cloaked. Well, they've been mating with our women again since 1920s. And and their children now have grown up and taken over our government around roughly 70 years ago. America is no more. They love to pee on you like a dog pees on a tree to leave its mark by leaving their symbols all over our society. My like Marco which means fallen angel in a different language. Like Nike, Mercedes, Mercury, Starbucks. Some of these were Nephilim, part fallen angel, demonic being, and part human. And some of these symbols represented the gods themselves that came down and mated with our women. Four or five thousand years ago, they were destroyed by a great worldwide flood. They were destroyed by a great worldwide flood that pretty much wiped them away. Now they're at it again. They're doing the same crap they did last time. And if they don't do three things, stop hurting humans, stay with your own kind, and don't hurt animals. Anything outside of that is going to be judged by 2029 and it's going to be one of the worst punishments that we can't even imagine. But if you're not involved in high treason and you're just a regular guy like me, you're okay on God's list. We, you know, we all make mistakes, we're all sinners, but we follow our Ten Commandments, we pray daily, we put God before everything else, and in doing so we lift His holy name up and we humble ourselves before God so He'll lift us up on the Day of Judgment. You got their citizens in America that are saying their local doctor and dentist in some cases are putting alien gray implants inside the patient. Now, when I think about this or even realize that I probably have them inside of me, I tell you that is enough to cause anyone to have a panic attack. This is as creepy as things get. It's like Twilight Zone take me away. What's going on when we're in the world where the Constitution is being completely destroyed? Thugs are running the government at the very top in things like Pizzagate, where there's all this underground, where there's all this underground satanic child sacrifice rituals to the devil. Many emails to Podesta and others are speaking of horrific acts. I'm still in the torture room. You have to kill this pizza before you get the next one. These, are, and then they're using pizza language. These are like connections, the FBI say, to underground child sex slavery. Uh, ritual abuse and execution to the devil. This is the really, 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 really real world that we are living in. And if we don't get together, find a way to organize, and legally, peacefully remove every government official at the top of the chart, then America will soon be destroyed. Americans in general have turned their back on God as a nation. We removed God from our schools, from our courtrooms, and whenever a nation removes God whenever the Bible always talks about that nation gets destroyed. America has been standing for hundreds of years and we've never been under this type of threat. World domination by 
supernatural forces, fallen angels, reptilian hybrids, and human satanic sellouts that are all going to meet their fate within the next 11 years. And it won't be pretty. So we need to raise awareness by organizing, protesting peacefully, going door to door, passing out flyers, letting the public know about the treason this government has committed on we the people. In my case, it was attempted murder. Two huge marine guys in my backyard at one o'clock in the morning trying to crawl up through my window. And when I called the San Diego Police Department, they confirmed that they were in on it. When the police department shined their flashlight behind my studio, said nobody was there and left. 30 minutes later, somebody ran from behind there down our driveway onto the street. So you tell me what kind of fucking creepy world we live in when the government can just go around murdering their citizens at will. Homeland Security, it's a farce. The police department, it's a farce. They are all guilty now, which means that the law has been wiped away. If they want to hold us under law, now they can do whatever they want to do. They can, they can kill us, rape our children, sell top secrets to Russia, like in the memo, uranium that's ready for nuclear bombs. But we have to basically be slaves. Pay them everything we make and don't growl back. Well, I say no! No! We don't take it no more. You organize, you and me, get out there peacefully and change the system. God bless you all. Thanks for watching.